find the volume of the solid generated when the region bounded by y squared equals to 4x and y equals to 2x minus 4. We work about y axis. So when we finding volume, we work about y axis. It will be pi, lower limit until upper limit. And then the function need to be in terms of y squared for respect to y. So we draw out the functions here first for the first curve. y squared equals to 4x, it will be parabola graph open to the right hand side because we have a positive coefficient x. Then we try to find out when x equals to 0, you can notice that y equals to 0. So their intersection will be at origin. So we can draw out the graph. So parabola open to the right in the set at origin. Then label, which is y squared equals to 4x, label origin. Then second graph where y equals to 2x minus 4, this is a linear graph, straight line. When x equals to 0, they are intersect y equals to 4. So going up, positive gradient. y intersect equals to negative 4. Then we label our graph here. This is linear graph, which is y equals to 2x minus 4. Then we observe the region bounded by the curve and this linear. It will be observed horizontally. So we will going to integrate respect to y. So now we have to find out what is our lower limit and what is our upper limit here. So to find out that upper limit and lower limit, we need our function to express in terms of y to find out their intersection point. So for the parabola, four x will be equal to y square. So x will be one over four y squared equation 1. So for the linear, 2x will be equal to y plus 4. So x as a subject divided by 2, 1 over 2y plus 2 equation 2. So we are going to substitute. Then to find out their intersection point. So we multiply by 4 in order to get this quadratic. Move it to the left hand side and we can factorize. So the intersection point at y axis here will be equal to y equals to negative 2 and y equals to 4. So lower limit, negative 2, upper limit, 4. So now we're going to calculate volume of this region. So volume will equal to pi integrate from negative 2 up to 4. Negative up to 4. So observe that this region is bounded by two curves. A curve at the left hand side and a curve on the right hand side. So for this two curve concept, we are going to use the right hand side curve minus the left hand side curve. So the right hand side curve will be the linear in term of y. It will be 1 over 2y plus 2 squared. Minus the left hand side curve here will be our parabola. 
So power parabola in terms of y it will be one over four y square square then dy. Then we can start integrate. So you can see this is a bracket of linear. So straight away, if I want to integrate it, we will get 1 over 2y plus 2 power plus 1 over new power. Then coefficient of y is 1 over 2 minus. So for this, simplify first. So this one we can see equals to 1 over 4 y power 4. So integrate this will become power plus 1 y power 5 over new power. Upper limit 4, lower limit negative 2. Then we're going to perform our step upper limit minus lower limit. So substitute the value of 4. So this is upper limit minus lower limit. So finally, you can evaluate using calculator. For volume, we put unit cube. 